Hello everyone, I am Revenano and welcome back to Undertale. Whoops, I am accidentally put some wrong keys. So in the last episode we learned a little bit about more of the world of Undertale and we also encountered Undyne and that kid and then Undyne dragged the kid away. So ah, here's a path that wasn't here before. Whoa, what is this place? You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? You hear a passing conversation. Of course I won't laugh. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under, standing under the sky, looking at the world all around. That's my wish. You hear laughter. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish too. Aww. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return and the underground will go in. I this angel of prophecy? Probably not. Knowing this game. Yeah, knowing this game that makes no friggin' sense, even to itself sometimes. Yo! Hey, weren't you dragged away by Undyne like 10 seconds ago? Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo. You're human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now. I mean, Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. <laughs> so, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of just think of that. <laughs> say something mean so I can hate you. Aw, I don't want to say something mean. Please. No! Yo, what? So, I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I hate your guts. Could you be so mean to me? Man, I... I'm just a turd. I'm gonna go home now. That's for the best. Uh-oh. Um... Uh-oh. Wait, what did she just do? She did something. Oh. Yay, I saved him! <laughs> Yo, dude. If, if you want to hurt my friend, you're going to have to get through me first. Aw, he's defending me. That's a little odd. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Yes, being enemies was just a nice thought. We'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I think my parents are worried sick about me. Yeah, you really should. Before you fall off another cliff. Later, dude. Am I a dude or a chick in this game? I be getting mixed and like it looks like a female character, but like a lot of some characters are referring to me as dude, although he could just be using dude just as dude. I'm gonna go under the same pretense that my character is female. Because that's what it looks like me at least. I don't know. What do you guys think? Is the hero of Undertale male or female, or does it not really matter at all? Oh. Seven. Seven human souls, and King Asgore will become a guy. We've been over this. Continue with plot, please. Six. That's how many we have collected us. Whoa, wait. They've already collected six human souls? How is that even possible? Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. Oh, I don't want to do this voice for an extended period of time. Can we skip this, please? Sum it up into 20 seconds. That'd be perfect. It all started long ago. Now, you know what? Screw it! Why should I tell that story when you're about to die? Yeah! Yeah. Whoa, fish person. You are standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alfie's history books made me think humans were compassionate. But you? 
You're just a remorseless criminal. You wander through the caverns attacking you when you pass. Self-defense, please. You didn't kill them because you had to. You killed them because it was easy for you. Because it was fun for you. Do you think it was fun when I found out the lesser dog, who wanted nothing more than affection, was dead because of the whims of a single human? No. But your time's up, villain. You won't hurt anyone else. A knight in shining armor has appeared. And out the pain you've inflicted on the fallen. Every hope, every dream you've turned to dust. She's gonna send right back through her spear. Meow. I'll show you how determined monsters truly are. Kill on. Step forward and let's end this. Oh yeah, epic boss fight. The wind is howling. You're filled with determination. Alright. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come. Whoa, I probably... End guide. Undone sex. Um... Gonna readjust my headset here and double check recording timers. Wow. Boy, oh, and the, um, um, why is my heart green, by the way? Hmm. Challenge or plead? Challenge. You tell and die, and her attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. Um, as long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on, you won't last a second against me. Oh, what the f- And Dan draws her finger across her neck. Um... Leave for mercy? You told Dan you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. I said face towards danger, I meant face towards the bullets. Okay. Um... You tell Dan her attacks are too easy, the bullets get faster. Not bad! Then how about this? Oh! Suplex is a huge boulder just because she can. You tell and die and her attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. For years we've dreamed of a happy ending. Oh, perfect! And Dine thinks of her friends and pounds her out with her fists. You can tell and die and her attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. And now, sunlight is just within our reach. Oh, how did I do that? <laughs> Smells like sushi. Mmm. I actually don't really like sushi. You tell and die and her attacks are too easy. The bullets get unfair. Oh. I won't let you stand it away from us. Um. Oh, why do I have to put like half my thing items away? Yeah, enough warming up. Ow! You're cheating. Um, can I spare her yet? Nope. Past Asgore. Oh, this really gets unfair. You tell her dying her attacks are too easy. Well, it's getting unfair. Honestly, killing you now is an act of mercy. Oh, come on! The really slow one distracted me so hard from those. Tell and die her attacks are too easy. The bullets get unfair. Oh, come on. That really isn't fair at all. Dude, the crab apple, you recovered 18 HP. So sappy, so damn resilient.
Oh, snap. <laughs> she doesn't care. <laughs> Anyone else would be dead by now. But I brought a lot of snack foods with me. Oh. Off so many humans were determined. Oh, wow. These sound dino attacks are too easy. The bullets get unfair. I see now what she meant by that. That's just not fair, the ones that go around. Uh New Quipal issues! But I've determined too! Oh, what is this? Uh Determined to end this right now. Ooh. Let's get faster right now. Dying, you just want to be friends. She remembers someone. Her attacks become a little less extreme. <laughs> I was like sushi. Oh, I hate this one. First time I've ever actually gotten a game over. Interesting. Oh yeah, we're back here. Uh, anyway, I'm out of time for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you're enjoying the series, leave a like and comment down below. And subscribe to stay on all series that I do. And I'll see you all next time. <laughs>